welcome back to another episode of Life is Feudal Third Forest Wind. Hello gamers, I'm Martuari and welcome back to another episode of Life is Feudal First Village. And yeah, let's continue where we left off. I've been getting some comments in my uh, in my uh, YouTube channel that uh, the village is doomed to fail because I've been concentrating too much on building and not enough on resource gathering. So yeah, maybe I should uh, definitely get some uh, some stuff going. Let me pause a few things. I have these two guys working, but I, I definitely need more wood because I will need firewood and I will also need some more stone at some point. Have 19 people? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 1 is 10, which means, yeah, those three still have to uh, grow up quite a bit, so... Uh, mm -hmm. It's summer, which means I should have people in here. What's this? The carpenter shop? Yeah, maybe uh, the orchard. Mm, I think I think I only need the orchard guys at the end of the summer. It's like yeah, let's do that. Let's let's remove this one and make sure we gather some more materials and have room for uh, expansion up here. So this area will get me 70, uh, which is quite a bit, quite a bit. Yes, some hay, some stone, whatever. Let's do that for now. I'm playing currently at twice the speed of the game. And uh, oh yeah, I have another farmer up here True. Yes, I have two fields. This is a potato field. This is probably a, a grass field. Yes, and the grass is needed to get hay. I'm not quite sure if I need that right now, but we will see how things go. So I have this guy here, the first is large, who is getting wood. Maybe I should enable disabled tree planting. Enable disabled tree cutting. I wonder, this is probably disabled now, yes. Huh. This is the hunter. The hunter should be getting some more resources. I need more meat. I definitely need more meat, so let's add one guy to that. I have pretty much enough fish for now, so I can remove this guy. Remove the fisherman, and then the fisherman will uh, go do something else. I have a thousand fish, so that should be pretty much enough for now. Uh, I'm gonna take a break on the building, because I, I really want to have... Uh, an area set up for farming first. Uh, this carpenter shop is getting made. Yes, that's getting made for the for the tools, the normal tools. This guy is getting produced. This guy isn't doing a thing yet. I think it's it's late summer. I should be turning this on because I have the impression that the rest of the year it doesn't really do anything. So yeah, when summer hits, I will be turning this one back on. The game will be. Well, involving a lot of waiting, I think, especially at the start of the game. That's what I've heard from other people. It's like, yeah, you have to set up a few things and then wait for more people to arrive. But of course, when more people arrive, that will mean I will need more food as well. Ha ha ha. Food. Let me check this. So this doesn't do a thing. Humidity. I wonder what this, this means. Current humidity is pretty low. This one has humidity pretty much low as well. So I think having my farms close to this water well is something which is really required. Because I have the impression that uh, they have to bring water from the water well to the, uh, to the farm in order for them to be able to cultivate stuff. You see, now they have some water. Let me check this one. This one should have some potatoes pretty soon. Good. Firewood is coming in. Firewood is coming in quite nicely. I think I will need a lot more firewood though. Uh, I was able to get through with uh, about 500 last winter. Let's make that a thousand. Once we have a thousand, he should uh, he should do go do something else. Yeah, 
definitely go do something else. But that does of course mean I need more wood. And I still think this guy isn't really... Mm -hmm. They have to make a big detour in order to get there. Let me check. So this is a road. Is there a way to get my road up top? This is the road getting up top. I don't really think so. Come on. Remove some trees up here so I can see a thing. Gather everything up here. Remove these these two trees or these few trees. Yes, do that. At least I will be able to see something then. Nothing is being done up here because I don't. I only have one builder. What am I missing? I'm missing. Oh yeah, I'm missing logs. Let's put this guy on pause for now. Put him on pause. We can restart that once uh, December is over. I think 400 should do for now. You see, now they will have some wood. Wood which can be used to uh, build stuff. I definitely need more wood. Stone as well. Let me check stone, yes. Ores, I still have a bit. Clay, I still have a bit. Have no hay. Have an okay amount of firewood. I don't have any vegetables at all. Uh, these will be vegetables, I think. Once they are done, they will be vegetables. Uh, this is hay. Mm, not really what I had in mind. But here yeah, we will have to wait until something starts happening, I think. Let's speed up the game a little bit. Oh yeah, they are clearing out the area here, which is nice. As they are placing building components, logs everywhere. So yeah, I will have to speed up things a bit, wait for a few things to happen, and then we will be able to continue, I think, 385. This seems to be going okay. Meat is coming in, coming in slowly, but it is coming in. I will definitely need a lot more meat though. It's not like I have uh, an excess of meat. I don't even have any vegetables. Mm. 394 out of 539, which means I will have to wait at least a little bit until fall probably before I can start harvesting these. Did I pause this one? I didn't. No, no, it's paused. Great. Play. There. It isn't paused anymore. This is going okay, but I'm not quite sure if I need the grass. I don't even think I, I need it at all. Okay, this seems to be a nice little area where we can put up some farm, farms for the next uh, the next summer, the next well, the next season. This is this one is doing okayish. This one doesn't be seem to be doing a thing. I think they are terraforming something or placing roads. Yeah, that's also something I will have to do. Once these trees are cleared, I will have to terraform this a little bit so I can make sure this road connects. And I think I will be winning some time then because uh, I have the impression that they have to walk all the way around in order to get to the village, which is making them lose a lot of time, a lot of time. So this is going fine. This isn't doing a thing. This little thing should be getting built pretty soon. I'm missing hay, which I don't have. So yeah, the grass farm will be coming in handy pretty soon. Summer is still here. This is doing pretty much okay. Now I can make these guys go collect everything. I think that's the whole point. Oh, they are already collecting automatically. Good, 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 good. So this will generate some vegetables. And once they are done with that, I will be able to pause that because I don't think I will be uh, uh, able to uh, have another set of potatoes going before winter hits. I don't think that will be possible. So these are collecting the hay, which is good too. And they will be bringing the hay to this area. 
so this thing can get built. I think at some point they will. Although they first need to fill everything up. This one is getting the potatoes, which is good. Potatoes are getting filled up again. See, I have 18 vegetables, which isn't all that much, but it's it's a good start. It's a start. I, I should probably have about a thousand, a thousand fish, a couple of hundred meat, meat and yeah, 500 vegetables to get through the winter. I have no idea. I will have to... Uh, to look at it actually see how things evolve and continue from there on but i think for the time being we will have to wait just a little bit before yeah things are getting produced and stuff let me check this area uh no let me see what if i would place a potato field up here where are the potatoes again fish there is a field here, yes, and I think how's, how big is it? 10 by, let's pick something 10 by 20. Should get me a nice field going, I think. Let me cancel that. Can I get any closer? Of course, night is falling again and I can't see a thing during the night. So let's wait until night is over before we set up that farm as well. Uh, I think this is doing okay. This is doing pretty much okay as well. So I need a new field. A new field which will be a... I can build there. Could I actually place a road in between? I have no idea. So let me... I think this is taken. Leave this open. Have a 10 by 20... This is 11. 10 by 20 farm going. There, that's one. Maybe I should get another one set up. Uh, yes, this will be it. So on this corner. No, not there. Somewhere up here, I think. 10 by 20 again. Should be two vegetable things. Let me build some roads as well. I think the roads were up here. Yes. Can I put a road in between? Oh, yes, I can. Nice. And then have a road connecting this as well. Great, 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 great. I'm getting some logs done. No, can I? No, what's this? Oh, yeah, you see, it's making a big detour. And that's the whole problem I think I have here. So I should probably be terraforming this area. This is a terraforming run. No, it's not. So terraforming. Why does it say dirt road? Create a flattened slope. Something like this. We will see. It's late summer already. Which means this guy is getting everything he needs. I can start building this. Oh, it's already getting built. Nice. So this one will surely be some more, uh, some more vegetables. Because I will need those at some point. Vegetables. I should probably add a well somewhere in the area so they don't have to run up here to get water and bring it back, uh, back up here. Maybe that's a thing. Flax is getting done. Huh, the apples are still a bit messed up. But can I now place a road in here? Have they done their terraforming job? Can I maybe connect these two roads? No, I can't do it yet. I think we will have to wait for that. Wait a little bit. So yeah, this area is clear. This isn't doing a thing yet. I can pause this one. I will be building this farm as well. Although I should maybe turn it as potatoes. Okay. See how it goes. Early fall. Yeah, there, there is no way I will get production going before uh, before winter sets in. And I don't think potatoes grow in the winter. <laughs> they, they normally shouldn't. Okay, have some stuff going. Uh, this is getting built, I think. I need the tools. Tools. 
The rest seems to be okay, but I definitely will need the tools at some point. So I need a builder in here as well. This guy isn't... Why is this one not doing a thing? Come on, you could be fishing, collecting stuff. Uh, building? Yeah, let's... I think I should probably have... Let's put you into building. Are you still idle? Yes, you are idle. So let's, let's put you into building. There you go. You can start building stuff now. Okay, let's slow down just a little bit. See what these guys are doing? Okay, I think the slope is doing fine now. Can I now connect this to that? Almost, almost, man. So I need some more terraforming, I think. Flatten the slope, let's see. Cannot build in this area, why not? Something like that. At least they are not making the big detour yet. Well, anymore, I should say. Let's see, the road. Can I have the road? The dirt road going from here downwards? I can't. Yeah, they are probably still in the process of terraforming all that. Maybe that's a thing. I have 100 wood. I have 200 hay have 400 firewood, I should be turning on the firewood production again. There you go. Go ahead, produce firewood up until we reach a thousand firewood should be good. Ooh, my, my bread is going. I definitely need more hunters. Why are they going up there to collect stuff? I have no idea. No idea at all. So how is this going? This is okay-ish. This is done. There's still 32 grass in there. Carpenter shop is done. Which will mean I need a carpenter. And a carpenter will need stone and logs. Oh, I need so much stuff. It's incredible. Let's have a look at our little village from this area. And yeah, it's starting to look okay. As long as we can survive the winter, everything should be fine. But yet, the little toddlers are getting teenagers and soon the teenagers will become adults. And once they are adults, we will have some additional building first. This guy is building. Good, 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 good. This is on pause. Is there anything I can do? It need 27 degrees. Grass as well. Flax. Same thing. Fast growing. Potatoes normal growing. Wheat normal growing. Oats fast growing. It's already fall, so I don't think I will be able to... Uh, to have something up before the winter. Let's make it potatoes. This one is potatoes too. Let's change it into potatoes. Okay, and put you on pause for now. I think I should probably re be removing this one. How many potatoes can I make here? A thousand? A thousand? Which means I can get rid of this. Once it's done, I should be able to get rid of this and maybe maybe produce something else up here. Maybe have... I don't know. Maybe have some oats. Wheat, maybe? Hmm. Okay, what else can I build here? Can I build another road? Heading from this place? It's difficult to see in the night. Let me see. I think I placed the road. I will have to wait until dar uh, darkness is gone. Let's see. This one is done, I think. 
Yes, so I can remove those two. Well, at least one. This is done too. Yeah, let's remove the two farmers. Two farmers. I definitely need more firewood, which means I need more logs. Logs are obtained by these guys, the lumberjack. Let's put one guy back into the fishing area. Yes. And maybe have a hunter, additional hunter as well. I don't have the people for it. Okay, speed up just a little bit. Four of the second year. Oh yeah. I hope we will be able to survive the winter though. It's looking uh, okay for now, but if people say that I was concentrating too much on building, not enough on gathering resources. Uh, well, at least we have some fish and some vegetables. I don't know if it will be enough to survive the winter though. It's fall now. Hmm. I'm keeping my fingers crossed, but I have no idea. So where are you? What are you doing? Getting flax for... This guy? Oh no, I need the, the road again. Yes, the road. That was what I had in mind. Make a road like this. No, like this. Make the road go like this. Can I actually... Oh yes, I can. That's nice. There you go. We will have some roads pretty soon, which is nice. Okay, check everything again. Ah, uh, low on vegetables. Fish is pretty much okay. I have no meat. So let's assign one more hunter. Ah, this is not good. This is not good at all. What's this? This is the lumberjack. Oh, the foresters. I have two foresters. Great. This is a lumberjack. Yes, which I need. This is the carpenter, which I don't have. The apple guy, he, isn't, he hasn't been producing a thing. It's almost winter. He's just running around. Nah, <sighs> that's not good. So I guess I have no fruit. No fruit at all this year. Two fish, but where is the rest? That's three. Four and six is ten. Oh, I only have ten. Yes, I need to wait until the others grow up. That's a thing. Okay, well, uh, let's let's continue up until we're close to the winter and see how we get through that. But I think maybe uh, I should have built those sooner. Let me add something here as well. I need a water well. If I can find it. A house, not a house. Barn, not that. Where is the what is that community thing? Resource gathering. Furnace. Clay mine, ore mine. Ah, I will have to check that out next time. Roads, decorations, fences. Castle structures, municipal buildings, a port, a school, a tavern, herbalist, healer shop, a pyre, a crypt. Oh, here is the well. Here is the well and winter is approaching. Winter is definitely coming. Let's put down the well. 
and remove all our... Uh, it makes no sense to having these guys here. So let's remove those so we have some additional people to do other things. But I think it's a good time to wrap up today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button. And if you have comments or suggestions, feel free to post those in the comment section below the video. While you are there, feel free to also check out the description. That's where you'll find links to the social media pages, links to my Patreon page and links to the other crazy folks and creative misfits guys as well. Uh, feel free to also subscribe to the channel. Not only do you help me reach my next subscriber goal, but you will also get notified when I post new content to the channel. That being said, I will be wrapping up today's episode. So until next time, have fun and stay safe. Bye. <laughs>